My name is Andrei Nevidomsky, and I'm the Cutting Competence Lead here at Vault. Our mission is to create technology that brings joy, simplicity, and better earnings to neighborhoods worldwide. We operate in 30 countries and over 1,000 cities with more than 50 million registered users. In 2022, we joined forces with DoorDash, and together we continue to dream big and expand our reach. We originally built our monolith service with Python, which served us well for rapid prototyping and early development. However, as we transitioned to microservices architecture, we began adopting Kotlin. First in our fintech and payment solutions, where correctness and reliability are crucial. Kotlin was an obvious choice due to its strong type safety, concise syntax, and excellent Java interrupt, which gives us access to a wide range of libraries. Naturally, Kotlin was also the go-to language for our Android app. At Wong, our teams choose the technologies they work with, and many have gravitated towards Kotlin simply because they enjoy using it. The organic adoption speaks volumes. We use both Cater and Spring Framework with Kotlin. Cater, being Kotlin first and fully integrated with coroutines, offers a flexible and straightforward approach that appeals to our engineers, especially those coming from Python and other languages. Its explicit nature, without hidden annotation magic, has been a big plus for our team. Since adopting Kotlin, our engineering community at Vault has grown both in diversity and engagement. We now have more than 150 engineers working with Kotlin, supported by a similar number of active repositories. The language has also helped us to reduce type miscast incidents, and our internal tools built in Kotlin now allow us to launch new services in minutes instead of days. This has significantly enhanced our developer experience and shortened our time to production. We plan to continue using Kotlin for our backend systems, and are actively hiring Kotlin engineers in Finland, Sweden, and Germany. Beyond the backend, Kotlin remains central to our consumer Android app, and we're exploring additional mobile use cases with it. We're excited to see where Kotlin takes us next.